Hey y'all, it's a whole, I think two days later. Yeah, two days later. I totally forgot to pick up the camera again after church. It was a whole lot going on. I'm making pasta today, so we're at Walmart. Picking up a few of the ingredients that I need. I want heavy whipping cream. This is gonna be my first time making this type of pasta. I got the two main things I needed, which is heavy whipping cream. This is the only one that they had. They didn't have any other brands that I might have been familiar with. And then sharp cheddar cheese. Now I just need to get the chicken. I walked away from that section because it was really clustered. There's this girl following me around at Walmart, so I had to kind of jet it. Even though I have to kind of go back over there, I'm giving it some time until she's not there anymore. And I, y'all, maybe she's noticed me from social media, but she keeps staring at me and whatever aisle I'm in, she goes in the same aisle. There's no car in hand, nothing. And to test it, I went from the cleaning stuff to the food stuff, then I went back to the cleaning stuff. And she was still on my tail. I went all the way to the back of the store to where like the milk was. And she was still there. Oh, she's right there. I'm gone. Never have I ever experienced that a day in my life. But y'all, I literally had to jet out of there. Like my mom wanted me to get more things for the house besides the stuff that I'm cooking today. And I was like, uh-uh, I'm not even staying in here. I literally grabbed my stuff and I literally jetted it to the register. Made sure she wasn't following me at that point. And then I left. And even as I was walking out, I was looking over my shoulder and I was looking around my surroundings. I was checking my car. I did all that. And there's a police that was parked like right there. I parked in the front of the door today. God, thank you. And the police was right next to my car, kind of. So I was like, okay, you know, but I was still on edge. I'm looking around. Maybe she's somebody that's seen me on social media or she thinks I'm pretty or she thinks I'm ugly. Like whatever it may be, she was so intrigued with my face because every time I looked up, I'm locking eyes with her and she's like still looking at me even when I lock eyes with her like, what? That's so weird, but oh my gosh. And all the stuff you see on TikTok, Instagram, people following people to their cars and all those other weird stuff. Y'all, I was so scared. I'm like, I need to like get out of the store before something crazy happens because one thing about me, I'm a fight. Self-defense, I'm defending myself. Off rip. You come at me, you better come hard. No, I was definitely going to defend myself. I was already on game. I'm like, all right, worst case scenario, what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to swing her one of these boxes in my hand and I'm going to have to drop her. I'm going to have to, I was already trust me y'all i already have my plan in mind like what i was gonna do let me hurry up and get home because i'm in a parking lot but the police is still right there so <laughs> it's the day after that girl tried to follow me at walmart i don't really know what was going on yesterday i think i'm gonna stop recording in the car because it's always like this white glare in the back i think i have to like fix my settings a little bit and also i have to get something new when i'm recording while i'm driving because the one that i have it keeps breaking so i might get the one on tiktok shop because i've been seeing a lot of reviews on that one it looks like it's really good to hold the camera and it won't break i'm not gonna lie I, maybe it's just me maybe i'm the problem or the way i'm putting the camera on that's not how i'm supposed to put it on so it's just not latched on correctly i really don't know but on today's agenda i'm meeting up with the dancers in a couple of hours i'm gonna get food and i'm also gonna be working on my business for a little bit i'm also gonna be doing some studying and i have a couple of jobs that i have to call like i said your girl's trying to lock in this job because i'm stepping fully into my career so i've been applying to different places i haven't been going to the same place for the interviews so the last interview that you guys saw in the one from the previous month those were different jobs totally different jobs and the one that i'm trying to call now is a totally different job it's just different companies that i'm trying to work with and i'm just trying to see my options testing the waters a little bit you know the more money that you make the more happy your life will be especially with inflation y'all the overall goal in the future is to be a full-time content creator but until then like i'm gonna push for this career and the career would also help me to be a full-time entrepreneur spread my wings and fly into the direction that god has for me i've been doing a lot of praying and i just want to stabilize my mind to make sure that i'm comfortable and i know that i'm good but yeah if you have any tips on making sure like the background is not white when i'm driving or when i'm in a car please help me because your girl is struggling i don't really know what to do about that i'm really confused later on tonight i also have to go to like this church event my brother is going to be preaching a couple of our youth members are going to go with him i'm helping them like record the guy who's hosting the event he put me on his social media team so your girl gonna be helping out a little bit recording behind the scenes things like that so tonight i have to figure out what i'm gonna wear it's really like a youth type of thing i can dress casual but at the same time like i wanna i wanna wear something cute heading to church now i stopped for gas before i hit the highway because we got a 30 minute drive and i'm on e guess who i'm with y'all 
Hey y'all. These are new contacts that I put in today. I feel like I can see the world a little bit differently. Everything's brighter now. You guys didn't get to see me get ready. So y'all wanna check out the fit? Yes, Red turtleneck. And then we wearing these. The lighting is a little off because we are heading in right now. We're here at the church. I'm already late y'all and I'm on the team. So toodles, we'll see you guys hopefully during service or not. Hey guys, I'm with Samantha. Guess what we're doing? Let them know. This hey. is your thing. <laughs> yeah. <With us. laughs> this is what we got accomplished. And we, get <laughs> we got these big ones. Let's see how we gonna blow them yeah. up. Y'all gonna hear music in the back, but let's go. You ready? She already, you already got it. Yeah, but it's like. We don't have the balloon machine, so <laughs> we're doing good. Yeah, this one's good. Oh. <laughs> I cannot. Let me see if I can tie it. But I'm, I still don't. I think it's, yeah. There's, I think it's, the, yeah, it is for the arch. It's for the arch. Boy. Let me see. Yeah, it's for the arch. This is good? The size? Yours, hers is bigger. It is? Yeah, yours is bigger. Yeah. Yours is no, bigger. it's the shape of mine. Oh, yours is more um oval. Oh, mine so is more circle. Like so leave it at like this. Yeah, it's, like it this. is for the art. We're tying the yeah. balloons now. We did it. <laughs> With these big old things. All right. We've been blowing, blowing, and blowing away. Y'all go like my recent picture that I posted on my Instagram if you didn't get a chance to do so. By now, it's gonna be a couple of days since it's been up, but this is the picture in question. Yeah, go go like, go like it ASAP. Cause what if you're doing if you're not following me on Instagram? We're making it taller, right? So we need more balloons then, no? One, two, three, four, five, six. We have six black. Silver only got three, so we need three more for the silver. I'll do the I'll do the small ones. Well, I said I'll do the small ones, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Remember the big ones? Wait, let me do, let me finish those. I need three more for those, and then silver? I'm gonna do the small ones, yeah. I'm doing the silver, regular, so and then I'll do the small one. Five, six, seven, eight. That's eight black mm -hmm. First, two black eight. to silver, two black to silver, two black to silver. So I need three more balloons. Yeah. No, sorry. Three, I need five more balloons, because you said there's eight black, I need five silver. Mm -hmm. We already finished the balloons, but she's about to do my lashes for me, so. I'm trying to measure it to see because oh. your eyes are small. So once we get back to the house, I'm gonna show you guys the finished product. I had made a video, but I made it with my phone camera, so I'm not gonna insert that. Maybe I'll insert pictures, because I might forget. If I forget, then once you see the pictures here, then no, y'all not getting no pictures when I get there, or videos. We'll see how she do with my lashes. She did her so cute, show them. They're the clusters? Yeah, the clusters from Shein. Ha, Shein girl. All she do is buy Shein. Shein, sponsor my girl. Because what are you doing if you're not sponsoring Samantha? Samantha B. All right, as you should. your eyes, ma'am. Oh, Lord. It's so hard. No, uh-uh. Uh-uh. Open one, close one. She don't like that, y'all. Oh my gosh, it's so hard putting lashes for people. And by the way, the reason why we're doing this, we got invited back to the party. Get low popcorn to our fit. The fan died. The oh yeah. Okay, this is better than the baby lashes you had. Y'all, the lashes was so cute. They was like nice and natural and mm -hmm. little. Oh, the baby, the baby lashes. <laughs> <laughs> um, what does that do? Huh? What are you telling me to do? No, like. But you look really pretty when you have when you have lashes and stuff on. <laughs> not sure blocking one eye. I'm not gonna pull them off. Don't take it off. I'm gonna leave them because I want to wear them for tomorrow's service and I'm gonna put my contacts back on. Just hopefully I don't cry tomorrow during service because I do that a lot. But God just be touching me. That's all I could do. I'm gonna come back when my lashes are done because I look crazy. Okay, so this is with both lashes on. I look so different. 
I don't know how to feel. Maybe because like I don't really put lashes on without my makeup being done. So, but I'm gonna wet and mousse my hair just a little bit. Like I don't want it to be too poofy, but I don't want it to be too laid. If that makes sense. Like I like it in the middle, like that perfect balance of tamed but a little wild. I'm wearing the same dress that I wore. I wore it for my birthday, and then I wore it again like early May. And now we're in September, about to be October, I'm wearing it again. I said I was gonna give it away, but for some reason, everything else left except for that dress. So I'm just gonna wear it again tonight. Hopefully get some sleep for church tomorrow. This is the final look of the night. Lashes, no makeup. And Samantha's looking cute in the back. Don't mind the wig. We're girls. That's how we be. That's how we do. We. <laughs> We're heading out now. I'm not gonna pick it up when I go inside because I feel like that might be a little weird. Y'all, a lot been happening, but at this present moment, at whatever time it is right now, I want to show you guys something that happened. This was my goal before September ended. Obviously, now we're in October, but I made my goal. Right, officially, as of September 26th, which was a Thursday, Thursday night on September 26th, I hit 1K subscribers. Congratulations to me. I am... I'm excited. I've, I'm excited and ecstatic at the same time. So I put it together, ecstatic, whatever. This is an NJ CEO shirt my mom got for me when I first launched my company. As you can see, he has stylist, personal shopper, all those things. No, literally my mom ate when she got this shirt. But I'm so excited. Thank you guys so much for getting me to 1K subscribers. My next goal is 3K and then 5K and then we're gonna keep going from there. Don't hesitate to subscribe to your girl. Obviously, if you like my personality, you like my videos, then you should tap in with me. What's to come for the channel? Like I have so much in my mind. I'm gonna be doing more sit down videos and talking videos. I'm gonna slow down on the vlogs. I've been wanting to do that for a while. I wanna post twice now in a week, especially now that I have 1K like, we. <laughs> If you're into faith, I have a lot of faith-based content that I'm going to be doing. I talk about God a lot, Jesus a lot, I pray on my channel. I was getting my hair done, so maintenance is definitely going to be key. I love talking clearly. I have a lot of story times under my belt. And I really want to go more into the church aspect of my story times because being raised in a church, y'all got some stories. I got stories for days. And I could tell a whole, I could write a book. Like, you see how Kim Porter dropped her tell-all book? Another crazy, obviously, but... I got another story time, but I'm a little iffy because, you know, I got to talk to God about it first. Like, God, should I talk about this? Because I don't want to ever represent myself or misrepresent myself. If I'm professing to be a Christian, you know, there's certain things like I want to be real with you guys. And I don't want to just do things off of emotions just because like, oh, I got a story to tell. Let me tell my truth. Nah, I really want to make sure that it's led by God. I pray on my channel, y'all, and I pray over it. So literally everything that I push out is because I'm like, God, should I post this? And I pray over it. I'm like, God, protect it now that I'm putting it out in the world. Anything that's coming up is definitely going to be things that I want to push out more. Y'all know I got the paint from my room. It's just sitting here, honestly. And I was going to paint it myself, but then I didn't want to make any mistakes. And my dad was like, don't do it. I'll paint it. And he hasn't done it yet. So at this point, I'm going to call in reinforcements and we're going to paint my room. That's going to be a whole nother process. And I feel like once I do that, change the color, I'll feel a little bit more comfortable because sometimes just seeing this blue wall, I've had it for four years. It's kind of like, all right, let's get it together, girl. Like you're grown now. Like let's, let's figure it out. I want to do a photo shoot with my 1K. It's just going to be on my iPhone. Nothing crazy. I want my hair to be done. Obviously, I don't want this no more. So this got to go. I reach 1K. <laughs> if you're here for a chaotic, real, raw, authentic, then this is a channel that you need to be on. If you're not really into God, Jesus, that's okay. This can still be your spot because we keep it real over here. And even if you heard a lot about him, you never heard about him like this. This is me reeling you in. I'm knocking at your dough. I was waiting for you at the dough. So let's go. I'm gonna buy my 1K balloons. Probably gonna buy a little cake and I'm gonna do a little thing right here and just take my pictures in with my camera. I did take pictures with my camera. It's the picture that you guys probably saw earlier when I was setting up the balloons, the one that I said, go like my picture on Instagram. I took that with my camera. It came out super nice, super, super clear. So I think I'm gonna start taking pictures on my camera. I think it makes sense. I mean, I bought the camera for a reason. Let me just use it. But I am thinking about making a second camera purchase, getting the Canon. I'm not quite sure when I'm gonna do that. So I'm just gonna figure out the timeline. We trying to get all these old footage out the way so that you guys can see a new, oh, wow. <laughs> so that you guys can see a whole new me, a whole new world and a new process, new type of content, quality. 
I feel like my quality is good, but it could be better. I feel like it's good, but it's not great. And I want to get to great lighting, all the essentials, me just bossing up, rebranding myself in general. All of that's coming. Yeah. 1K is crazy. Wow. It was hard to get here. It started out really low with engagement and nobody was really watching my channel like that. So that's why I was, I would come on, then I would hop right back off. Cause I felt like the views wasn't going there. It wasn't until I really got into who I was and learned who I was. Standing more so in my truth is when all of this came into fruition. One app may be good for me and it's bad for somebody else and vice versa. And I feel like you just really got to find where your audience is going to be at and then try to then bring them over to every other platform. So now I'm trying to bring everybody to my YouTube. If you follow me on Instagram and you watch watching this video, you need to subscribe. If you follow me on TikTok, you're watching this video, you need to subscribe and send it to everybody that you know that know me. And even if they don't know me, send it to them anyways, because at the end of the day, they need to follow my channel. They need to be a part the channel <laughs> tell me congratulations because if you're not then maybe you're my hater <laughs> but you want to be that bye guys thank you for tuning to my channel thank you for subscribing and i really do love you guys thank you for getting me to 1k like ah!